Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be talking about two important topics. One, on how to do a currency conversion on your Mumu app. And two, how to withdraw your sum of money back to your savings account. Let's get started. First, open your Mumu app. And next, you will click onto the US margin account. On this page, it will show you the withdrawable cash amount that you can withdraw from your account. So if you take a look at it, under my example, the withdrawable cash amount in my US margin account is zero. Hence, this shows that I will not be able to withdraw anything. Okay. Thereafter, if you really want to do a currency exchange, click on the icon located at the bottom here. So after clicking on it, it will reflect on it will bring you to this page whereby the default currency exchange page will show that is doing a conversion from Hong Kong dollars to the US dollars. But this is something that we are not going to do for this. What we want is actually an example to do from US dollars to Singapore dollar. Okay, so we're going to change the option over here from US dollar to Singapore dollar. Okay, on this page again, once you have selected that, it will show you the reference rate. Okay, reference rate basically means the conversion rate that you'll be getting. So because I'm doing an exchange from US dollar to Sing dollar, it will show me that I will be getting $1.31 for every US dollar that I exchange. Okay, next I need you to pay attention to the estimated completion time. So because I'm doing this transaction on a weekend, it will only take place on the next business working day which will be on next Monday on the 7th of June. Okay. Now, before you click on the submit button after keying in the amount that you wish to exchange, I like to bring out two important points to highlight. Number one, the type of bank account that you are transferring to. If let's say you are transferring over to a DBS multiplier account, do take note that such multi-currency account, they can actually receive the money in US dollar. This means that you do not even need to do a conversion if you wish to purchase an item or something in the future in USD. Okay, if then next I need you to think about it and see if there's actually a need for you to do an exchange in Mumu. Okay. Can I directly transfer my US dollar to a SGD bank account instead of doing the conversion through Mumu? Well, actually you can. But one thing that you are foregoing in that would be the ability to see the exchange rate that your bank will be offering you. Okay, so that means you won't know what is the exchange rate that you'll be getting. It can be better than 1.31 or it can be bet it will be worse than 1.31. Okay, do take note also that the bank rate uh, can also fluctuate, meaning that you may not be able to get the most value amount of money if you were to do it that way. For me personally, I feel that it would be better if I can see how much money I will be getting. And if let's say I'm okay with that particular amount, I will click onto the submit button for me to proceed with the exchange. So in this example, in assuming that I have 50 US dollar that I would change i will be getting 65 dollars and 98 cents in uh, sgd okay so you just have to click on submit but because i have zero exchangeable amount it will show me as an error showing that the balance is insufficient okay so next i will be talking to you about how to do a withdrawal from your sgd to your sgd bank account so after you have done the following conversion, let's say uh, after selling maybe your Apple or your Twitter stock and now you want to transfer the uh, money to your Singapore bank account. First, you got to click onto the SG margin account. Okay, again, take a look at the available funds that is listed on this particular screen that you will be able to withdraw. Okay, look for the withdraw button at the right of your screen is over here and click on it okay so after clicking on it it will bring you to this withdrawal page okay first you got to ensure that your your you're actually transferring from your sg margin account and not from some other account that you are doing okay so like for the previous example if let's say you want to uh 
con no need to do any conversion you want to move your us dollar to a to a multi-currency account you can just select as usd okay so then you can just enter the usd amount but most of us will be probably doing it from uh to 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 spend the money in sing dollar so i will just use sing dollar in this case and thereafter i will select the bank account that i'm transferring to okay so uh it will take approximately about one working day for the whole entire process to be completed uh do note that if let's say you are transferring over to a dbs or posb bank account there will not be any service fee involved uh however if you were to actually uh do a withdrawal to other bank account there may be some transactional fees that you will actually incur so what this means is that if you were to transfer to a PS, POSB or DBS account if I were to withdraw $200 I will get $200 reflected in my savings account one business day later however if I were to withdraw it from let's say my SG margin account to my let's say another bank XXX bank okay i instead of getting 200 i may be getting a slightly smaller amount after deducting the transaction fee that could be about maybe two dollars or maybe more so i will be getting probably about 198 dollars okay so i hope that you have actually enjoyed uh, watching this tutorial video okay don't forget to smash that like button and we'll see you on the next week in our investment journey thank you bye bye